first time. Just try, try again. I believe in you, Ryan. You're doing a great job. Yeah! So this is the Beechwood. And this is my buddy Sandor. And we are on the amazing Winstob uh, timber lot. So I'm going to carve a simple feather. So this will be a how to carve feathers for beginners. Now this is a really easy way for carvers to learn how, if it's your first carving and you just got a carving bar, or even if you don't have a carving bar, this is gonna be a simple, quick, how to tutorial, real time, because it's gonna be very fast. This is the same piece of beech wood that we found on the log last night. It's a nice I'm on the beach looking for some beech wood. Yes, I love beech wood hunting. It's one of my favorite things. So, I'm carving on big timber right now, which I'm super excited about. It's on History Channel. You'll be able to check that out in the summertime. No, in the fall. But we're here now. So let's hope, if we're lucky, we can find. Oh. So let's head back to the truck. Look at how pretty it is. Apparently the salmon just come ripping in here in the summer. And it is fish on, baby. Nothing jumping. Nice old growth cedar. Too bad it's been in here for 20 years. So really I'm just looking for something that's gonna jump out at me. Like, like this would be a cool Dremel carving. Very small. Maybe this could be it. I'm gonna bring this, because this is cool. Cool. It's a nice little chunk of cedar and what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna accent the le uh, Feather into here and then leave it down to what it was for the bottom. So this is kind of a one-shot deal I've talked too much already. Let's get this going. You Nice got full-on pro everything Okay guys, so when you're starting out Okay, so you're starting out, you just look at the log and you try to figure out what it's gonna be. So for me, I see that this is gonna be like a nice feather. You don't have to use everything, but just try to use as much, as the, as much of the wood as you can. So your blocking is first, let's go.
pretty much it. Locked out right there. Very simple, very fast. Now, I like to do a little bit more on the back. Actually, you know what? Because it's beechwood, I think I'm just gonna call it and I'm gonna sign it just like this. So there it is right there, pretty much done. But what I'm gonna do, oh, is I'm gonna lightly burn it and give it a little bit of burn. You don't wanna go crazy because this is a really nice kind of cool piece. I gotta edit all this out because I can't have the carving on. What's that? I've given her but I don't want, I, I'll get in trouble if the carving's on. Uh, fire. Answer. So this is a really easy piece for anyone who is, oh, and this is Kevin, the star of Big Timber, and that's Sean, the filmer. And uh, you guys make sure that you tune in to Big Timber season two on History Channel in the fall. And I don't know if anything's out there yet, but I have heard it might be on a streaming service one of these days. So all of my American friends and followers, you guys get to uh, keep your eyes peeled. It's an awesome show. He's a great dude, has an awesome family. And I've had a great time here, so it's gonna be wicked. And uh, so this is it, just a light burn, little sand. Okay, so this is a very quick feather. Very easy to learn how to do. So if you're just beginning carving and this is something you wanna learn, just practice it. And if you don't get it right the first time, just try, try again. I believe in you, Ryan. You're doing a great job. Yeah! That feather is like it fell off a bird. <laughs> He's the man. You guys tuned into Big Timber on History Channel. So, this is for my friend Sandor. Thank you, my friend. Oh, thank you. So, my name's Ryan Cook. Thanks for watching. And these guys are awesome. Big thanks to Kevin and his family for having me here. We'll see you later. Yoo!